Good morning, good morning, good morning everybody. Thank you, thank you, thank you for being here. Today I have pulled from Conscious Spirit Oracle Deck by Kim Dreyer. And I have pulled number three, transformation. Number three resonates with the energies of the Ascended Masters and indicates that the Ascended Masters are around you, assisting when asked. The Ascended Masters help you focus on the divine spark within yourself and others and assist with manifesting your desires. They help you to find peace, clarity, and love within. The number three resonates with the energies of optimism, joy, creativity, inspiration, intelligence, speech and communication, good taste, and sociability. Transformation. Our card says, I journey within to meet my higher self and to find true happiness. Society leads us to believe that possessions and external things will bring joy, happiness, and contentment. But that's not true. Real lasting happiness can only be found once you go within and connect to your true self. This card reminds you that transformation must begin from within. And only then can you decide, or yeah, and only you can decide to begin this journey. By acknowledging and understanding the darker aspects of self, as well as the inner light, you can begin to move toward greater understanding of who you are and what direction your life needs to move in. Light casts shadow. These two are intrinsically bound. Often, it's our shadow self that gives courage and strength to live in the light. Be gentle and kind to yourself on this inner journey. Know that all, at all times, you are guided and supported by beings of light and your higher self. You can only take this journey alone by following your intuition, or you can seek guidance from books or people that you trust. There is no right or wrong path. Your path is unique to you. Follow it with courage, strength, remembering to always show compassion and love to yourself as your true self unfolds. I love this card, and it truly is a beautiful reminder that we are unique, and our shadow selves don't have to be scary, those darker aspects. When we keep ourselves in balance, it truly is those darker aspects that give us the strength and courage to be that spark of light that we are, to stand up, to stand out, to be willing to help and assist others, to speak our truth. It takes a lot of um, going in and seeking, understanding our darker aspects, our negative parts, right? Because when they're in balance with those light aspects, it really puts us in a place of inner peace, balance, which helps make all the difficult things in this 3D matrix of a world easy to understand, um, easier to flow through. There's always going to be pain. There's always going to be shadow, dark. However, how we deal with it and the balance of it all begins with us going inside, seeking ourselves, and making peace with all aspects of us and what makes us unique. I love you all so much, and I'm grateful that you're here today. Be gentle and loving with yourself as you transform into whatever it is you desire. I love you. Have a beautiful, beautiful day.